How's it going, you insane lords and lasses out there? I'm that game fro. And, oh, I have a confession to make. I may have beaten Shrouded Insanity off camera. Yeah, I know, I know. So what I'm gonna do for you is I'm gonna play as Sagrat. He's one of the four bosses, and he's my favorite character in the game. With that out of the way, let's do this. How's it going, audience? I'm that game fro, and this is Shrouded Insanity Speedrun Edition. It worked perfectly, stuff we did, we brought this guy back to life, oh, what do you know, I mean, he's gonna ignore the lesson, sleep till you get to the manor, and blah, blah, blah. This guy looks a little different, doesn't he? Well, especially if you saw episode one. <laughs> this is Sagarat. He's one of the bosses. He's my favorite character. He has a light blade slash. He does not have any sort of long range. And his heavy attack leaves a shadow image that does a combo. Which is pretty much his bread and butter. Notice how much stamina that's not taking away. My clone army! Alright. Here we go. So, first, if you're attempting to just get this all out of the way real quick, go up and left. Uh, yeah. <laughs> there might be a woodsman or two. Ouch, dude. That's not cool. Normally, I think in speedruns, you just like kill what what's necessary and you walk away but I have a habit of not wanting to leave work unfinished a little bit oh what's up Mr. Paladin let's just talk to him for a second oh one of Waltham's eh? no <laughs> I'm actually not sorry you'll find out later oh duelists duelists are really the only people who won't die immediately to stagger it was that painful I hope so. That's because Mr. Saggy here is just too powerful. Also, his after image is wrecks everyone. Like he doesn't. It, it's basically a uh, a taunt with damage um, attached. Attached damage. I wonder if I can get that to catch on. So yeah, I was hitting him with my sword, and I was doing plus three attached damage. Ooh, oh yeah, that's uh, to heal yourself. It doesn't actually hurt anybody. Oh, what's up, Gray? How's it going, buddy? You ready? So be it. May you rest in peace. So, the storyline... Oh yeah, spoilers. Spoilers, we're gonna get into the storyline. The storyline has you just waking up as some sort of zombie dude. We're not really sure who we are. But I have no- oh. <laughs> Gray, Gray's dead. But you notice that when you enter this battle, he says, So be it. And then you can actually talk to him. He says, Do what you will. I will never beg to a dog like you. <sighs> I don't want to reveal too many secrets, so I'm going to kill everyone. You'll just have to figure it all out on your own. Uh, suffice it to say, though, that, um, you know, Gray was cool. He kind of fights just like you're the main character, so, in a way, I felt like they were close. Hint. Uh-oh, battery acid. What's that good for? I don't have a car. Whoa, crap. My cooking is not that bad, lady. You take that cleaver away. Sagarat, Sagarat, he certainly is not Spider-Man. God, it's such a good ability. Who else is in this house that I can totally murder? On my way to beating the game, I wonder. Whoa, the butler! Wow, he stood no chance. Make your time. 
She also stood no chance, but we kind of knew that, didn't we? Doesn't this look like a trap? Like, doesn't this look like these pianos are just gonna go chong? Oh. Smash right into you. Oh, pretty sure there's a trap around there. Okay. Sorry, ma'am, we have to go upstairs. Oh, do you hear that? It's the one bit of music in this game. Elegant piano. Here to remind us that bloodshed does not have to be gruesome alone. It can also be beautiful. Something to enjoy. Something to love. Something to... Who the frick is this guy? Uh, it's Howard. He, you trade this man, this boy, uh, for stones. And the stones improve your character. Stronger, and also the stronger you get, the worse things happen in this mansion, so. Like the worst monsters show up. What's up? I think not. Maybe in here? Yes. We're headed to our next tour spot. Oh, who could it be? None other than Haito, the third knight. It's kind of a badass, actually. And this would be sort of a difficult fight if I wasn't the great Sagarat. Master of clone damage. He's the great Sagarat. He's not gonna die to some sniper punk. Again, like I'm, I love this game even more when the music is on display. <laughs> Go, clone army! Fight them both! Ah, oh, you are a very talented duelist. Unfortunately, you are dead. I think not. The great Sagarat cannot be defeated. Oh, except if he gets shot right in the face. That's that's never a good sign. Sir, stop dancing and die, please. Sir, sir. I don't want to die, so we're just gonna get rid. It's fine. It's fine. Thank you. Don't drop bombs at me. You drop bombs on me. Ow. Oh, unfortunate. Unfortunate. Now, your sweet, sweet death! Hmm. I wonder what Hito, the knight, could have told me had he not died. I wonder what they would have told me if they didn't die. Oh well. Let the blood flow. I am the great Zagarat. Who else? Who else needs to die on this murder train? Murder train. Ah, hey! Quit your telescope. Tennis. <laughs> Quit your tentacle periscope action, which is now going to be called the telescope. <laughs> Up tentascope. Looking for intruders to slap around a bit. I'm just gonna walk right away from you. Hmm. Normally, I could go to Waltham to heal, but ugh, I don't think I'm going to die, so. Oh, you missed. That's unfortunate. You missed a spot. Namely, the blood stain you left on the ground. I think I took a wrong turn. Yep. Took a wrong turn, you distracted me, my lady. What's up, dude? What's up? What's up? How's it going? What's up? I don't want to fight you. I'm going this way. Oh! -ho -ho -ho. Still don't know what happened in this room. The bodies are still warm. But whatever happened, it was not good. <laughs> Leaving. These are human remains. 
means actually it looks kind of like foliage. But your, you know, if those are human remains, I don't. Ew. Hmm. Childish drawings of a teacher alongside some chemical notes. The ancient Egyptian symbol related to immortality. And a familiar friend is in this room. Are you prepared for some Sagarats on Sagarat action? AKA the Battle of Saggies. <laughs> yeah, he's dead now. I am the only Sagarat who lives. Oh. Sorry, Sagarat. There can only be one badass amongst bosses in this game. Okay, so the next boss will probably kill me several times. I am the great Sagarat, but... Oh, oh, geez. Oh, man, get through the door, please. I'm probably going to die because, well, to put it gently, Len is a bitch, and her abilities are still quite potent to a boss. I do a lot of damage, which is great, but she can one-shot me. So this may take a couple of tries. I might... Um, fast forward and clip depending on how much of a game fro I turn out to be right now. He's really game throwing it up out there. Oh, no playmates to have fun with on the way to Len. Except for the butler who's now dead. Oh, butler, I thought you were going to do something. Serve me tea. Do list. Come on. <laughs> Thank you. You should have shot where I was, not where my clone was, and was also able to kill you. You get it. You get it. Just like her, she got it right in the stomach. Hello, was it me you're looking for? She's so tough. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Don't do it, yeah! Oh, that's the first one. It's like at least four, probably more to come. Ugh. Ugh, come on, Len. You were dead. You were dead to rights. <sighs> she was dead. Let's let's all talk. We all saw that, right? She was dead. <sighs> the angel of not being dead needs to be dead. How many attempts do you think it will take me? Let's all count. I'm pretty sure like four. Okay, here we go. Attempt number two. No? Ow, come on. J -j -j play fair. That is certainly not what I meant. No, what I'm saying is let my clones just fucking wreck you. Get school. Oh. I took... Okay, I don't know what the game's gonna do, because technically I won, but technically she also won. So... Don't talk to me. Don't even look at me. Yeah. That's what happens. Ouch. <laughs> I didn't know you couldn't attack him. Gotcha. That's what happens if you attack the contract holder, or the contract creator, once you've signed it. Hmm. You guys want to see something nasty? I think it's in this room. Yeah. Uh, what's this about? The mass is pulsating. Yeah. Gross. Okay, let's hope Lan is dead. Nope. We get to play again. Here we go! I don't like her, so I cast death upon thee. Ow, seriously, stop with the lightning. I get it. You wanted to be Storm all Halloween. This is your chance. Prepare for the death. This song is very sad. When? Say, oh God, come on. 
Stop doing that, please. Yes. Yes. You are so fucking dead. Die! Ah, uh, now everyone is murdered except for the person who beckoned the fog, a.k.a. the beckoner. Why don't we beckon him to death? Oh. Hmm. Hmm. It's held by relics, you say. Ow. I just got awful relics. I don't know why I didn't realize that. Whatever. So. <laughs> oh, I didn't know there was a butler in this room. Oh, well. Because he didn't know there was a saga rat in this room either. So normally, you'd get here and everything would be explained to you. I wonder why it won't happen for me this time. And that's my only clue I'm going to give you. Oh, shit. That is the very first time I've seen that. Huh. Horrid. Absolutely awful. Whew. Okay. Uh, let's sink the watch just so I can have full health and full stuff. And then, does he say anything interesting? He collected all the flames and the gate lies open. Well done, Vimir. Only the Beckoner remains. Show him no mercy. Prepare for a boss battle. Aww. I feel like something was supposed to happen in this room. Well, you certainly look familiar. Probably father of Sagarat, if I had to guess. I have no regrets. You better not. <laughs> You're about to die. Yeah, he's super dead. Don't, don't have any, okay. So here is the ending that I'm giving you. Uh, the speedrun ending. Ahem. Well done, you have fulfilled the contract. Like I promised, you are free now. As a little gratuity, I'll reveal who you were before you ended up in that grave. Spoilers. Really heavy spoilers. I've already said spoilers, but whatever, spoilers. You were the last ruler, rules, <laughs> of this cursed empire before your brother usurped and put you into an unmarked grave. You are free to try and take your throne back, and although that might prove difficult without the knights, I never asked you to kill them, so you must have had something personal against them. In any case, I'm certain you'll manage. Best of luck to you, this blood-covered kingdom in this blood-covered empire. And that is Shrouded Insanity, the fast way. It's a really pretty awesome game. My one... This is kind of loud. I don't know if I can fix that. Uh, my one... I guess issue with it now that there's loud music in the background uh, is there's not really a lot of music to it other than when there's bosses and that like upstairs room and I wish there was a little bit more here and there because other than that I really enjoyed this experience like when you're grinding um, which essentially is just killing monsters if you didn't know. When you're just killing monsters and getting experience to make your character stronger so that you can finally take on each boss. Um, it's cool, but it's also just a little boring because there's no music. And there's so many good elements of music in this game when they decide to add it. So, just a little, little critique -o. Anyway. I will catch you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. There, alright? I beat the game. Just like the contract asked for. Oh. I gotta do one more thing, I remember. I'll see you next time.